What's up everybody? Welcome back to another So Your Wife Wants You To. This is what the wife has been wanting me to do recently and I keep putting it off. Let me show you what's going on with this kitchen faucet. So, this kitchen faucet has been not wanting to turn. Um, instead of it going back and forth, like if you have to wash your hands in one sink and then wash dishes in the other, it's been turning down here where it goes into the counter top. And I wasn't gonna do a video on this, but um, I'm gonna try something kind of unconventional to see if we can get it. It looks like there's a lot of junk in that rotational spot right there. There's like a little plastic sleeve and there's some junk. I smell like vinegar right now because I've been trying to put vinegar down there and rotate it and it's not easy to rotate. We're gonna try the pressure washer and we're gonna pressure wash right in there and see if I can blow all that nasty gunk out. That's my only last thing we could do. I don't know what else to do besides just buy a new one. So we're gonna try it out, try to save us a couple hundred bucks. All right, I'm gonna hook it up. In the meantime, um, I would love for you guys to subscribe if you like videos on just doing random crap, videos where I don't edit out my hand blocking. Um, I do so much stuff, we just, here on this channel, we do what we can with what we have. That's our motto. And uh, let's get started. Okay, I got it in a bucket. We're ready to roll here. Um, we're gonna see if it works. Turn your volume down a little just in case it's loud. We do experimentation on this channel. It's not always the answers. It's more like this is the science. We're gonna see if it works. And if it does, great, help people out. But if not, you know, it's not always perfect. We'll do it a few times and uh, see if we can get any results. All right, what I've been doing is pressure washing the outside part, which is right here. As well as pressure washing it from the inside. And I've just been blasting it all different angles, different ways. See the water coming out of the other end there. And also like stopping to turn it and just kind of like turning it and working it loose. And it's actually working kind of well. It's not perfect, but it's way better than it was. I'm going to keep working it and uh, I think this might be worth doing. More to come here in a second. Okay, the more I work it, the more this I think it's calcium, it's, gr it's really gritty. It's like almost like rocks or sand is coming out. See, it's coming out of that seam. So I'm gonna keep working it, and try to get all that nasty stuff out of there. All right, so what I did was, I probably spent about 10, 15 minutes, uh, probably 15 minutes, just blasting the inside of this thing, blasting the ring around it, continuously like, making it go you know back and forth and also there's a little a little uh grub nut right here that i took out and i would actually have this on the ground and blast it inside that little grub nut hole while i was turning it and it's pretty loose now so i'm going to say this was a success you know some videos i post are fails and i don't i mean some videos i take i i don't post them because they're fails but we'll go ahead and put this one up just because um, it's a lot better than it was and it could last us a little longer it could help some people so let's take the final test and see if it'll actually not leak and actually work when I hook it back up so let's go try that now and it is all replaced let's turn it on and see Works pretty well. The main problem was this wouldn't sw this wouldn't turn. So now it turns with ease again. So I'm saying pressure washer 
is a success. I would also bathe it in vinegar just in case that helped um, loosen up all that calcium. And that is all for today. Feel free to give us a like. It helps us with the algorithms. And uh, check out the links for any um, pressure washers or anything else, any other tools that I put in there that you might want. Um, you can get them on Amazon. That's all, guys. See you next time. Back to work.